Hi, this is just a, a quick informational video. Um, if anyone out there is changing a timing belt, this is what they should do first. Right here is the crank bolt and um, it's there on the harmonic balancer. Behind that is the timing belt. Uh, this is a Toyota Sienna. It was well overdue for a timing belt replacement. But I know from experience the very first thing you should try to do before attempting to replace your timing belt is see if you have the tools and the means to get this bolt removed. So it's often very seized on there and can be very difficult to get out. So um, I was able to get mine out with an impact and a very good air compressor. So um, you need plenty of airflow and I use this 22 millimeter um, special socket right there and you can see how it has extra thick walls and that removes the deflection in the socket and just allows it to spin off um, quite quickly. It, it really helps the torque to zero in on the, the bolt. And so um, I can't express enough how important this was. I was unable to do it without this. So I got this for like 20, 20 some odd dollars on Amazon and it works wonders. So um, the impact alone with a regular 22 millimeter socket was not able to remove that that crank bolt so um, those are two words of advice have plenty of air pressure have an impact and um, use this special socket and start there because um, I've actually before pretty much tore apart my whole engine um, compartment on that one side to get to the timing belt and then really struggled to get this crankshaft bolt out and so um, you know if you got a friend that has a good air compressor and you don't have one um, has an impact just just go over there run that bolt out and then put it back and then take your vehicle to somewhere where you can then remove the timing belt but but as I said start here first make sure you can remove that before tearing apart your engine just a word to the wise thanks